I'm just looking at the raised uh, bed, which doesn't look uh, that exciting at the moment, but it's all full of uh, winter flowering pansies, which have done their thing. But don't be tempted to throw them away. I'll just show you now how to prune them back hard, and then they will regenerate, and you can enjoy a whole lot more colour in the months to come. So as I say, don't throw them away. It would be a shame. So I'm just going to show you how to prune them back in a second or two. So I'm just going to show you how far back I cut these uh, winter flowering pans. It's on quite uh, ruthless, so if you grab your hand and uh, find the where the uh, base of the individual plant is and then just cut that back quite hard. Can't do this because I can't multitask like most men so I'm just going to have to put the camera down and uh, pick it back up in a second. So as you can see I've cut that uh, one bundle of uh, about a handful of uh, greenery from our little pansy which started off looking roughly like that and now looks like that. It can come off as well, won't hurt. And then those will regenerate. Uh, you can always put some um, fertilizer on. I sometimes use these um, little uh, balls of fertilizer, slow release, which are quite good. It'll just give it a bit of a boost. Don't be worried about cutting the flowers off. It may seem a bit of a shame, but they're not very exciting at the moment anyway. And what you'll get back in return once you've cut them back to uh, these smaller plants will be magnificent by comparison. So this is the pile of greenery I've just cut off with my trusty Felco secateurs. That's probably just come off about six different pansy plants. So I've now just got to do the remainder of the bed and then as I say we'll give that a bit of a feed. It depends how organic or otherwise you are but I'll probably give it a bit of a feed with um, some um, slow release uh, miracle grow or something similar to that but don't shout at me i'm sure they'll all look lovely so that's now the uh, raised bed nothing much to look at at the moment but uh, i'll show you the transformation soon this is all the debris i've cut off that's a pile of debris about uh, 60 centimeters by 30 by uh, 40 so quite a big heap of debris as I say, don't worry about the lack of loss of flowers, it'll soon uh, catch up and pay you dividends. So, here we are. I'm just going to give that a sprinkling of uh, slow release miracle, miracle grow balls. So, in amongst there now, I can see some uh, rogue uh, bluebells which I don't really want there, they were left over from when I replanted it. Obviously, ones I've missed uh, might leave those just to uh, flower on as well and uh, uh, it's a good time to take out any of the uh, weeds that have uh, just starting to show their heads in between the uh, pansies so just take those out now and uh, you can just let it uh, do its own thing and uh, hopefully as long as it continues to rain a bit which doesn't seem to be in doubt at the moment uh, I'm sure they will all be stunning in the next few months